Hey guys, in this video I will explain about input 5 numbers then arrange into ascending order let's write the code click on netbin <coughs> file new project java is already selected project java application click on next button here you give new, uh, meaningful name input 5 arrange asc remove unnecessary comment at here here write package import java dot util dot asterisk after here take five variable tap is integer int a b C D A Take one more integer tab variable int C N T zero Create one class scanner object is S C new scanner system dot in it is for displaying message on the screen write system dot out dot print Allen for new line gives meaningful masses for displaying input any five random numbers the five number will store sc object next and copy and paste this one change very alert variable name b c d finally e now let's write for loop for i equal to 0 c and t not equal to 5 i plus plus here write if condition i f i double equal to a 
और ऑपरेटर कॉपी एंड टेस्ट फ्रॉम हेयर भी 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 चेंज द नेम ए बी सी lastly a it's done now here write message is system dot out dot print the ascending Order number for a space right slash t for can connect that number right i and hereafter c and t plus plus. Here I not defined. Now it's defined. We are gone. Everything all right. Execute program. No error. Input five number forty five five six thirty seven forty three. Oh my! God. This is a sending number five. No need to write this five times. It will print them. Simply write I fifty six forty five seventy eight seven nine. For a space does not look good. Slash T then plus. Now execute. Eighty nine zero nine eight six. Last day, seven eight zero nine ninety seven six. Now look at here seven eight nine seventy six nineteen. All are arranged into ascending order. Again. Eighty nine, seventy eight, forty five. Look at here, all numbers are ascending in order. It's done. Thank you. And uh, one more thing, I like to explain how the program is executed by the mat by try run method. Now copy codes select some area test. So here five variable then write it here a b c this is for d and e 
and one more variable count cnt integer type assign with 0 then what guys here all numbers are very bigger so ascending any 5 numbers let's take a smaller number 1 3 5 4 2 then 1 2 3 4 5 so here I like to take a equal to 1 this is equal to 3 this one is equal to 5 this one is equal to 4 this one is equal to 2 now this is turn now come to for loop integer i one more variable is i here i in a start from 0 and count not equal to 5 condition true then this will goes to here then what is the value of i i match with anyone not because i is equal to 1 1 not equal to 1 3 4 5 and 2 so this one come at here okay then here after here this is this will go for i increment okay then i increment by 1 this is 1 then 1 and check the condition after increment goes to here check the condition is it satisfy then count equal to still count equal to 0 ok and here count equal to 0 condition satisfy then goes to if match with anyone i equal to 1 and uh, i equal to 1 i equal to 1 and a value equal to 1 then this condition match with if any condition match then uh, this will directly goes to add here inside the inside and print the value of i so here output first is 1 because add here or or condition any condition true then this condition any condition true then all condition becomes true in uh, case of all condition or then here system dot or dot printed an i then one print and count with uh, plus plus count zero to one this is done then again this will goes to increment of i then i become two okay then this will goes to add here check the condition what is the value of count equal to one not equal to five condition match condition match then here this is one no then this become two okay then this become two then i equal to 2 a not match not match not match not match but here lastly match with 2 then again this goes to a n side system dot r dot printer and i this the output will 2 and here count count equal to plus plus means 0 to uh, 1 to 2 then this will again go to increment of i 2 after 3 then here this will check the condition count equal to 2 2 not equal to 5 condition is true then this will goes to here i equal to 3 i 
not match with A but match with B then this will goes to here system dot odd dot print and print this one and count plus plus count plus plus three and again goes to the increment of i i increment by four four then condition just check the condition uh, this is uh, count count equal not equal to five means three not equal to five condition match then goes to add here i equal to four then i match with four d then match with d then system dot r dot printer and four then count plus plus at here count plus plus means three after four okay then goes to here i increment by one means i increment by one means here five five then match the current check the condition count not equal to five means four not equal to five then uh, goes to if condition if i match with any other any others then here c means five i ma i equal to c this is match then uh, five equal to five then this this goes to at here system dot or that print ln i i equal to five this will print and count plus plus means four after five then here this will goes to means i will goes to here no uh, here what is here i will goes to six sorry not in here i is goes to at here six six then count count plus plus then count uh, five not equal to five means condition not matched then this will out of loop so hey, this is the rest of uh, this is one two three four five is our output i hope guys you understand thanks for watching